Hi everyone, in this video uh, I'll show you that how to install multi-born windows based machine that's very simple but for convenience I'm going to show you here and how to install it in Kali Linux machine and how to use it this is uh, something which I have sh shown in some other video but now for installing this multi-go uh, uh, here in this windows based machine we are going to launch this uh, browser here and uh, depending on the speed of our uh, computer it may take some time but after this we just have to write multi go and press enter and then this website will be shown here which I'll put in the description section as well and now you can see this is the website of multi go that is very interesting tool which will be showing us uh, the, the relationship between the entities and those entities can be our email addresses there can be phone number domain name so for detail I, I would recommend you to see that video but now here we see here we have the multi-go website and if you want to see the information here so in this product in this product you can see they have uh, different product and we can download here so first maybe we need to so this is like maybe I, I'm not interested at the moment in demo so in product you can see register for free so first to use multi-go we need to register ourselves here and then we just click there and here you have to give all these details and after that you will be sent a link to your email you need to verify your email address and then if you want to uh, let's say uh, download it then we just again have to see here in addition to that you can see they have actually different plans or different edition of multi-go here multi-go pro professional enterprise community edition reseller so we actually these are a paid version but the community edition is for free but we need to register for uh, register to use this so we'll be downloading this multi-go community edition today so if we click there let's say multi-go community edition and now you can see here this is a uh, download for free and this is says what is a multi-go community edition you can see here uh, details about that but here we are going to download it that is for free and then multi-go uh, and here she said multi-go also requires Java so we are going to uh, download that here and after downloading it will install downloading on our machine and you can see this has started downloading and it may take few seconds and after this we can actually see how to install it but these are again very simple step which we can follow and after a few moments we can see that this has been downloaded which is in our downloads folder so we can click there for me otherwise you can just simply go to downloads folder here click there and let's see we should have that in our downloads folder I click on downloads and you can see this is the only file which I have here so now after this we just have to double click there double clicking here it should uh, launch the process here and then we say yes do you want to allow this app we say yes we want to allow it and uh, we click yes and now you can see please wait and this is multi for 4.3 it says java runtime environment it needed so we say yes we want to install it okay and then it's, it will also install the required java and then see here and next click next and then we accept these all things of course you can read it off next and then I'm going to click next install and now this is installing multi go on our windows machine windows 10 and again it may take some time but this is uh, worth using this actually this tool this very interesting tool it will be showing all these things graphically to us so we finish it and after finishing you can see this is a welcome to multi-go setup wizard we click next and then install anytime using this computer yes and go next and then this is the folder destination folder where i want to install it and all these things by default whatever is there i'm selecting those otherwise you can read all these details but you can see the multi-go setup is is installing so we need to wait a bit until this is installed and yes, I was saying that this is a really interesting tool that we will have some entities like my name, let's say in my name and with my name, maybe uh, this name will be at, uh, will have associated email addresses, maybe DNS, maybe some other information. So this all information will be searched and uh, 
after getting all this information and this information will be collected and will be presented as a graph so that is uh, completing the mango setup wizard we say finish create desktop I'm not creating any shortcut at the moment so here this has been installed and we minimize it and then maybe click on start here and we can see top here we have multigo and the, just to launch it we click there and now this multigo uh, screen should appear in a few moments depending on the speed you can see multigo 4.3 is getting ready and uh, it takes some time to load all these modules because this will be using different transforms and transforms are actually small programs a transform or the function which are actually mapping or taking any entity as an input and giving multiple entities related with that entity and showing us a graph for that and now you can see we have first window and here we have different uh, addition of this multi ego you can see for them and we need to purchase them but here this is the community edition which is for free so we are going to use community edition we click on run and then we select this community edition and so with this community edition there are some transforms which we can use for free so first we have to accept all these condition and then say next and then i can see it has it started uh, in this process and here this is the login email address and password so here you need to have this email and password which you register yourself on that website which i showed you before otherwise you can also click here on the register here you can see here it is so I'll give uh, my details here and then I'll be back here and after giving this details again we have to click next and after giving details we click next and now it's showing that uh, login result and if everything is fine it should give us the next screen if we give uh, right I mean email password and captcha and it should uh, give us the second uh, screen but it's at the moment it seems like it's verifying so this has been verified now and uh, now we click next and now after giving those email addresses everything it is going to install the transform so transform are actually functions which will be mapping or it will be taking any entity like email address as an input and then it will be giving the related other entries maybe domain name or phone numbers these all things so these transforms are a very important thing May take some time for installing these transform and now it says that we have these following added updated and then we click uh, so if you want to send some error messages to them either reports to them if you are not interested at the moment and then web browser by default we select this and then do you want to use this in stealth mode it means you want to hide yourself we say maybe no normal and then we have uh, here um, we select that do you want to open a blank graph and let me play around so let's say uh, we, we we won't say okay with this we can maybe say open a blank graph here so now you can see the blank graph is being loaded this you can see this leave graph is written so this graph is actually a workspace where we will have entity and their relationship so we acknowledge it and uh, this installation is complete and now after this point if you are you want to see that how we can we can use it maybe other video where we have uh, this setup in Kali Linux machine so that video might be helpful for you for this video I think this should be the end and uh, hope to see you in some other video